Hey, friends. Dude, the Nintendo Direct was fucking <laughs> lit. Well, this will be outdated, because this will come out way later. Yeah, but we just saw the Direct. Holy shit. <laughs> it finally fucking happened, We're boys. popping off, because Marvel versus Capcom 1 and 2 and a bunch of other stuff are in a collection, and it's gonna be on the Fucking... Switch. Finally, and I, and I saw this, and I'm like, oh my god, oh my fucking god. Like, I think Max will see this too, and everyone's he's gonna tell people, fucking buy it. <laughs> everyone's gonna see this, and they're gonna go, there's hope. There is hope. There's fucking hope. Cause yo, Marvel would have had to allow them to do this. Remember? Yeah. They allowed them to license all these games. That is fucking wild. Oh, you're right, Zach. Like EGAD is in the game. Go to Cooper Trooper. Yep, I see Paratrooper. Spiny Paratrooper, nice. That's yep, cool. Not go to Lakitu. It will take a while, but we will see Bowser Jr. Oh yeah, Bowser Jr. is number six. And he's small as shit, but man. Yeah, that's how he is. He's, he's, he's in the game. He's in the game. Why are the babies so fucking huge and Bowser Jr. is so tiny? I, I don't fucking know. Actually, no, he's normal size, actually. The babies are the ones that are gigantoid. I'm gonna go on my Switch now and prepare my wish list. We get all these cool games. You get Silk Song. You still get no Silk Song. He is like. There was a lot of things, there were guys, there's a lot of things oh that made us pop off. Oh my god, fucking Silk Song fans are molding. <laughs> They're fucking... The one that made us pop off the most was the Marvel, uh, the Marvel vs. Capcom collection. When I saw the Ryu and Take You For a Ride, I'm like, I'm like, this is a fucking troll, no fucking way. I was like, like no way. Fucking way, and then I saw, boy, At oh. first I thought it was Street Fighter, but then, but then I heard, I'm gonna take, and I'm like, ah! <laughs> You guys don't understand. Half these games haven't been fucking Zach, they released. Made, they made a skibbity in game. decades. They made a skibbity toilet game. No, they. No, yeah, like, they did on no, the Switch. No, they, they did. fucking yeah, did. They did. They did. No. They did. No, not the stupid toilet. No. Yeah, they did. No, no stupid toilet, no! Yeah, I know. You know what? I'm gonna say this. Fuck the toilet. <laughs> fuck it up, fuck the to toilet! <laughs> I'm gonna put down- I'm gonna put- Stupid ass shit! I'm gonna put down the toilet like you put down a dog. This <laughs> is a little overlived its life. I'm gonna put down Skivvy like- like old Yeller. The kids are like, no, don't put down Skibbity. I don't care. No, but but yeah, Skibbity's done. Skibbity's done. Like everyone just fucking finds them. It's, no. it's a dead fucking meme. No, it's dead. It's dead. Everyone finds it cringe. Everyone finds it cringe now. It's over. The moment the mainstream media started talking about it, it became dead. Like like it it died. And then the kids are like. You fucking ruined it. Meanwhile, all of us reasonable adults. Yes. We're like, thank you. It's fucking dead. It's probably gonna update later. Yeah. Everything's gonna update but later. In mature collection, I. I respect uh, them for going safe and choosing Tarbok and Perfect Dark first. That was... Joe, to be fair, they're very ashamed of Conker. Conker's good. I know that they kind of are ashamed. Why? I... 
Oh, it's been said of a lot of, like, other people's YouTube things that Nintendo's... One game they're very, like, embarrassed about, Ace Conquer. Why? I... Joseph. It's such a good game. Do you remember what is in Conquer? Oh, uh, yeah. Sexual innuendos. Murder on a fucking no, no chill spree. Fucking yeah. references to pop culture. I would Dude. never be able to fucking go through to, through today. Hell, people can't even make new games without, like, getting in trouble with referencing something from pop culture. They can only do, like, at least one. Or they have to, like, make a really, like, small, tiny hint to pop culture. You can't do that nowadays with fucking licensing issues and fucking people like Warner Brother or whatever else being fucking stooges. But, Nintendo Direct had, um, it did have some fucking surprises. I did not expect a new fucking Mario Luigi game. That shit, they just started off with that shit and everyone was just like, okay. <laughs> Al okay. They saved Alpha Dream. <laughs> So you instantly got a new event and something else needed the game. So, Alpha Dream's back, Joe. They're, they're allowed to do games again. Yep. That's cool. But I loved that they're allowing creative freedom with the RPG games. And Joe, you know what really made me really excited? Yeah. There is fully original fucking characters. Yeah. And I'm like, okay... That kind of means Miyamoto has no involvement in these series. Anymore, yeah. Because after the last time he, he was nearly involved, yeah, it didn't go with Mario, Mario, just in particular. It, with the RPG series, he's like, you can oversee the games. Mario's his golden child. I, I, I get it. I fucking understand that. But you need to spice up Mario a bit. We can't always be in the fucking Mushroom Kingdom, my guy. Yeah. Look at Mickey! Mickey's... Mickey is getting so many new adventures. He's going to see p people he's never seen before. Yeah. So, why... Why shouldn't Mario? If Sonic and all these others are doing it, why not Mario? If Mario's gonna survive, he needs to do something different. Yeah. Can't just keep fucking having new adventures in the Mushroom Kingdom. Which, the reason why Zelda gets a fucking pass for this is because Zelda has different timelines they can use for, like, different games. But it's still confusing as fuck. And still go to different lands, but use, a diff but use a different links. See, that's the exception. But yeah, I was generally fucking surprised. Uh, Marvel vs. Capcom collection, and I, I, I can't believe I'm fucking saying this. The fucking Mad Lads had the balls to bring back Miles Edgeworth <laughs> Investigations <laughs> collection. <laughs> I saw that shit, I'm like, oh, oh no. <laughs> More people are going to be exposed to this fucking brain rot of a fucking game. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> if you guys have... There's a specific YouTube channel. I would 100% uh, look them up. They're called Jello. And Jello, uh, well, they're the guys who made uh, a little series. A little little web series. They're known as... Zach, you know what, you know what Russ just said? What? And it's worth Investigations 2 is the best game in the franchise. I'm so happy it's getting an official English release. Oh, what? What do you mean, Rustich? What do you mean? I've seen Jello play that game. Yeah, bro. <laughs> they brought back Mario. They brought back all the Mario RPGs in the span of a year. What the fuck? <laughs> fucking Paper Mario! Mario RPG! And fucking Mario fucking... 
and Luigi. And we actually got Metroid Prime 4. Finally. We get Metroid Prime 4, a new Mario Luigi game, a new Mario Party game, fucking Marvel vs. Capcom, uh, Phoenix Wright, uh, Miles thing, a new Zelda game, um, Donkey Kong Country Returns HD. We get all these games, yet still no Silk Solid. Oh my god, bro. Leave, leave, the, leave the Hollow Knight fans alone. <laughs> it's like the no bitches meme, like, all scientists say. Like, everyone, everyone can still find a couple, but yet you say, get no bitches. That's like literally what the meme is. Like, you get all this shit, but yet still no Silk Song. <laughs> I, I generally feel so sorry for Silk Song fans, but... The lineups... I... Listen, they can wait another year. <laughs> we, got, we got fucking Barb vs. Capcom. We got fucking Mario and Luigi. We got a new Mario Party that actually looks fucking good. Uh, fucking Metroid Prime 4. They can wait. <laughs> they can fucking wait. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the me fucking Silk Song fans. The fuck did you just say? You, Brian, you, you think we can wait for another fucking year? <laughs> yes, you can. And I'll talk up more in the next video. Bye, guys. Yeah.